by myself tonight. <laughs> she does not want to be on camera. My wife, Deborah. What we're going to do tonight is we are going to look at this right here. The Angels Envy 2022 cask strength. Now, before we, we didn't even open this yet. So this is going to be the first time we're opening it. We had it for, I don't know, about a year. Mm -hmm. We're going to wet our whistle with, this is 108 proof store pick from supermarket. So while we're unpacking this, we're going to, we're going to have a little schnabel. Let's you like that? It's a little like sweet. Starbucks. It's it's finished in um, port. And this is going to be the same thing except hotter. Oh my gosh. Whew. Isn't the box beautiful? Oh my god. It's worth it just for the box. I think it's like magnetic or something because it just really just... We got a good deal on it. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. This makes, good, makes for good TV here. Oh, yeah, there's a, there's a noticeable difference in the darkness. Okay, so we're going to let that breathe a little bit. <sighs> so we've been buying and collecting bourbon for a while. We've, we've been... How long Well, when we went to Cincinnati is when we first got into it, but we were just kind of like only would have one or two bottles in the house at a time, I would say. I'm buying one for his birthday and one for Christmas. She got me a Weller 12 the one year. I don't know if you can see the difference in the color. Probably not, but I can see the difference. And this one's darker. Um, it wasn't until about a year or so ago. Is it that long? Maybe two years. Have we been doing this? Well, well, two years. And because um, I remember cordially yours, we did two of their raffles. So that would be two years. Mm -hmm. But it really got amped up last year. Like we got freaking crazy with not it. Not me. You. <laughs> You're worse than me. Don't lie. Let's get another sip of this. That's good. It's hard to do. Okay. Well, we go into our local store, which is, well, they don't have much, right? And they got. Well, I, I have found good bottles there. We found an Elijah Craig 18 and a Jack Daniels 12 there, but pretty much. Uh, their pricing is uneven. And they got basic stuff. Yeah. Not, nothing too spectacular. But they, they have a bourbon section, and uh, it's been pretty barren lately because they said they were clearing the shelves for new stuff, but I have yet to see that. And this was about three shelving units to the left of the bourbon section. And for some reason, we looked there, top shelf, and there was this wooden box. And I was like, hey, What's that? <laughs> and then he brought it down, and we looked at it, and I don't know how we much. Left. Huh? And we left. Did we leave and come back? Mm -hmm. Oh, and there's a phone. Oh, uh, we're gonna have to edit this out because it'll be some crazy message. Okay, so we go home, and I don't know. We had a brief discussion. I don't, it seems like forever since we had this, and I can't believe we've never opened it. And I can't believe after one pour, it's down that far yeah, already. No for the love of God, this is 750 too. Um, we thought it was expensive. Then we went home and researched it and saw what a deal we were getting and ran back and bought it. What did we buy it for? 220? 220. No, it was, I think it was 220. Yeah. And it typically goes for 230. Uh, that's, that's, that's the MSRP. Yeah. And, um, so we're like, oh, we'll buy it. We never really spent a whole lot on a bottle before. So this is our first bottle that we spent a lot on and we haven't opened it yet. So we're going to try it in a little bit. Now the, uh, oh, 
I'm showing them this bottle. This is the bottle that we're drinking right now for crying out loud. I was like, oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, we drink so much already. No, we didn't drink anything. <laughs> This is, this is this is the store pick from the supermarket. I just realized that. Yeah, this is you know, um, this is the store pick from the supermarket, which we tried we there. It's our only first drink of the night. I know, and um, and we tried this at the supermarket, Niagara Falls supermarket, and I can't remember the guy's name there, but uh, he was uh, great. I have it written down somewhere. Um, but this is delicious. We liked it. And we got this for, I want to say, $76. And it was reasonable. And when I see posts on Facebook and things uh, or, or whatever, it's usually 99 or 100 So I was happy to get that, that bottle for that mm -hmm. cheap. Like see, okay. That's a little this, <laughs> yeah, that's, oh, holy crap. Can you see the difference right here? I don't know if you can see it with the white color. I don't know. Color. I don't know. Oh, yeah, you can see it. Yeah, maybe you can. You right? Can. I wish I knew the age statement. You know, no research before it. We're just oh, yeah, winging but... it here. It comes with a nice thing, and it's got, like, tasting notes and everything here. Um, yeah, $220. Yeah. <laughs> a very dark amber red. Nose begins with hints of leather, brown sugar, and caramel. Fou Followed by creme brulee, marshmallow, green apple, and citrus orange. Got both our dogs here. Bubba's gracing us with his presence. You may have seen him in previous videos. And Buster's here also. Oh, it's on the box. I'm such a, such a dope. When I was looking at the box and it says 2022, I'm reading it like vertically and you're supposed to read it horizontally 2022 i'm a special kind of slow i don't know if you can see it that way that's a beautiful box yeah we're not getting rid of that box i might just sell the box no we're not going to sell the box no. okay we're going to go in for the first sip yep. idle chatter tonight you get something weird um i don't know burnt at the end yeah um what does it say? Is that is that would that be molasses? Yeah. Apples, caramel, and brown sugar. The creaminess pairs with oranges from the nose, creating a dessert-like richness. Vanilla, toasted oak, and black pepper spice round it out. I'm not getting too much uh, spice off of that. Yeah, you are. Yeah. <laughs> Watch it! I see your arm in the camera. <laughs> Ooh, that one's sweeter. And I'm okay with that. I don't want it to be too sweet. Well, I like sweet. Yeah, I like sweet, but being for the proof it is. Mm -hmm. That's um, 119. What does this one look like? Whatever. What does it say right here? Yeah, this is like almost 120. 119.8. So it's not drinking like that to me. Yeah, okay. Like this could be, I don't know. The other one could be hotter. Mm -mm. No. You think this is hot? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is it worth two hundred and twenty bucks? I don't know, but the dog got one better. <laughs> this one better. <laughs> it's oh, tough to tell. This, this, got, this it's got such a interesting nose. I think. Yeah, I mean, there's something. I, I, I'll I'm, tell I'm you. looking at it and I'm trying to figure out what that is. I don't really get. I think I get the leather drying me out. Mm -hmm. Cre green creme brulee, stuff. marshmallow, green apple. I don't know, is that the creme brulee? I'm not getting creme brulee. It sounds like you would sweeten. Yeah, this is tasting like burnt molasses to me or something. I don't know. Maybe not, not in a negative way. Okay, you know. It's really sweet. It's tough to tell in the first pull. I know. I pay, you know, with the box and everything, I'm happy what we paid for. I've seen it for 400 I wouldn't pay 400 for it. No. And um, it's not one of those where I would buy it every year. I mean, it took us... A year opening. Yeah. So, that's crazy. Yeah. That's all they want. I'd like to come back to it again after it's opened up. Mm -hmm. uh, you know what? 
Give me a little bit more of that one. I knew you were going to say that. That the store fix does like so sweet compared to this one. That's okay. I, I don't want it like. Oh, leather, different. Yeah, yeah. But I'm just saying, when I take a sip of the store fix. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. <laughs> ah, you can't put that in there. Awful. <laughs> when I taste this, I give all the notes that say on this one. <laughs> I think I just got to throw that laugh in there. <laughs> I know, don't know why you're laughing. <laughs> I'm waiting for you to fart. <laughs> I'm just wondering, you know, the the cost. Mm -hmm. How much is that box? That's got that's got to be two hundred. <laughs> that's got to be a fifty dollar box, box. You know, I would buy that one again. That store pick again. Well, it's probably still there. Well, we got enough. <laughs> There's a bunch that I would buy, but that's one I would buy again. Yeah. Some some we get, and I try. I'm like, mm, I'm never buying that again. You know. Right. Right. But that I like. Well, I don't know how the 2023 version is going to be, but if you have the money to burn and you like the box, I like the bourbon. Mm, yeah, it's good. 220 bucks worth, a lot of that's the box. <laughs> but I don't think you'll be disappointed with the bourbon. Um, but for $220... I I don't know. You could get yourself a Russell's 13 or an Old Fitz or Nictor's 10. <laughs> 10, right? You're paying for the box. So if you want something that looks nice on your shelf, this is it. <laughs> Cheers. If you enjoyed the video, smash the like button, leave a comment below, <laughs> and subscribe to our station.